Hey guys, G Jerky here again with a bring you back with another movie studio tutorial. And uh, this time we'll be learning how to um, pixelate or blur a certain area of a video out. Now, important note, this video will just be on how to blur or pixelate um, a, a still image, um, not a moving image, which might come later on, we'll see. Um, but yeah, so this is just for a still image, maybe you like it in a sit down interview or if you want to pixelate a name or whatever. But um, alright, we'll begin, I'll grab a video. Alrighty, so I have my video, um, the classic <laughs> Star Trek face palm, and this will be, so the, um, the video will be moving, so the blur won't be as effective, but we can use it as an example. So, say there's an interview and you want this guy's face to be taken out of it because you don't like him. So, this will be a little bit more advanced than, um, uh, the previous tutorial we did, but, you know, once you learn, it will be, it will be pretty easy. But it is a little bit more advanced, but don't worry, you don't have to click away if you think it's going to be too difficult, because we'll go through this together. But, alright, so first step, actually, let's just take, um, we'll keep it as a video, I reckon. Uh, so first step we want to do is, um, make a duplicate of the video. So, you want to do that by a video, you want to right click and press duplicate track. Um, so here you go, you have double of the video, you might want to move that up to text just to keep it separate for whatever reason. Yep, so this is all there, there's the audio. And if we play it, there it is. Fun times. <laughs> Alright, so what you want to do is, um, actually, yeah, what you want to do is, oh, the, the bottom video, the original video, um, well, it doesn't have to be the original one, just the bottom one, you want to mute, so you want to press um, the block there, which means that if you didn't have that, and you apply a feature to this, it's going to apply to the bottom one, and the blur won't work. So, what you want to do on the unblurred video, you want to go Event FX, and you want to find Sony Cookie Cutter, which is right here, and um, get rid of that because it's annoying. Or oh, maybe we can't <laughs> mind Sony Cookie Cutter. All right, so you look, and there's a huge circle there, and um, so. So as you can see, you can make like a huge line, or I don't know if you want to make it like, maybe if it's not a face you want to blur out, maybe it's, um, I'm not sure, maybe it's like a, a word or a box or something, because you might want, you can put a, um, if you use a previous tutorial, you can maybe put a shape over the, the word you want to block out, but Sony Movie Studio won't give you access to every corner. It cuts you off about, like, here, which is where this would come in. Um, so basically, you want to not do that. You want to have your circle line, of course, change the size, depending on the space. And you think, well, how do I move it? All right, so you want to go into center, find it, and here we are. You just drag this around to where you want it. You want to make it smaller, because you don't want to have the whole screen, you know, pixelated. So you want to fit it just to his face, maybe adjust it a bit, because we don't like his face. Have it in the center, and that's good. All right, so now, um, if we were to unmute this, it's just normal, so we want to keep that muted. Um, so this is a cookie cutter, and now we have to go into transitions, uh, not transitions, sorry, video effects. And find out what you want to add. So this can apply to anything. You don't have to be blurring anything out. You could be making it um, black and white. You want, might want to make a face black and white or something like that. Um, but in this scenario, we'll be blocking it out. You can use, uh, where is it? This Gaussian blur. I probably just butchered that word. Um, I don't find it to work as well. If you want to pixelate someone's face out, you want to use, um, as suggested by the word, you want to pixelate it. 
probably large, the smaller it gets, the easier it is to see. So you want to just drag this onto here. And as you can see, it's pixelated pretty heavily like that. So, you, you know, you can like tell that you can like see the face, but you, want, you can't see the features. Now, if you were to unblow this, see just the face is, um, just the face is pixelated and uh, nothing else in the video. But of course, as you see, as you move on, the pixelation's moved off his face. Um, which is why, what I mean when I say it's not a moving image, it's just in the one place, which would work if the camera was there the whole time. Um, so that's how you work. Sometimes, um, even though you've muted this, it pixelates the bottom one as well, so you just want to go event effects, and, um, or let's say you had deform in, you want to just go, um, remove selected plugin, and we'll remove it, and just the thing is playing. Um, so that's basically, you could add whatever you wanted, say if you muted this, maybe you, I don't know, maybe you don't want to blur it, maybe, uh, sorry, pixelate it, um, you want to get rid of that, maybe you just want to, uh, I'm not sure what you'd want to do, maybe you do a round max, maybe, if you wanted to, uh, see, that looks, that, that could actually work for pixelating someone's face out, and see what I mean, now you have to, um, go, because uh, now the whole thing's like that, but you can see like the circles, you just go event effects, move, and it's all good. Um, so I hope that helped, and this is the exact same if maybe you want to blur out a word, like if your name's in the video you want to blur it out, it's all good. So that's the tutorial, that's basically it. Um, and then maybe in the next tutorial we can talk about how to make the pixelation move, so that when you play um, yo, yo, it's not just not just sitting there um but yeah i hope you enjoyed it if you found this helpful feel free to give it a like subscribe share share it with your friends and i'll see you guys next video thanks for watching to make it smaller so the bigger you make the box and if i move this down the smaller the video gets and now you can see that the happy Wheels video is on top of the gg